Hey, good morning, Parkside. Welcome to this week's encouragement video. Thanks for tuning in. Hey, you see I'm in a different spot here. I'm on my back patio and I'm looking over the cornfield in the back. Uh, and I just woke up this morning to a beautiful view of the sun rising and kind of the, the fog lifting over the cornfield. And uh, it's it was kind of a remarkable thing to see the beauty of God's creation, to see a field uh, that is ripe with any and a sweet corn and the fog just kind of lifting as the sun rises. And I, honestly, here's what it made me think of. It made me think of our Bible Institute uh, and the Vine and Ablaze, our Sunday night ministries uh, that we launched last Sunday. And it reminded me of uh, just this uptick, a, a higher percentage of people attending who've never attended before, some of which are not Christians at all, some of which have been out of church for a while. Uh, they're looking for depth. They're looking for people who will take them deeper into God's word and what it means not just to know God and his word, but to love him deeply, to be a disciple and to make other disciples. Uh, and, and Park said it encourages me. Here, here's what I'm encouraged about. I want you to see this as well. I see our church making disciples, seeing people around them, establishing a culture of discipleship where it's normal. It's the expectation. It's the regular thing that disciples are making other disciples in their life. As they go, they're seeing people in their life and saying, yes, I can help you follow Jesus today in simple ways. And in our Bible Institute, we see people inviting others, bringing them into that journey of following Jesus. And it excites me greatly. Uh, and I see that the cornfield in the back, I see the fog lifting as there's a vision of the sun comes down. And here's what flourishing looks like. Parks that I see that in you and I'm encouraged by it. This coming Sunday is a, an exciting one for us. We've got uh, a continued uh, study in our series, Not Your Own. What does it look like to challenge the cultural narratives that say you belong to yourself? Look inside for your truth. Uh, and so I hope you'll be there. Uh, I'll be uh, opening up God's word, talking about what it means to embrace a view that you are not your own in relation to our finances. Uh, really exciting to, to look at what God's word says about that. Uh, Park said, there's there's so many other things I could talk about. I uh, won't belabor the point, uh, but I hope you have a great day today. I hope you look for opportunities to make disciples. Who is it in your life today that you can say, I can help that person follow Jesus? That's what it is to have a culture of discipleship. And I hope you'll plan to bring somebody this Sunday to Parkside to hear God's word explained and grow together with his people. I love you. Hope you have a great day. We'll see you Sunday.